Aurora here of AskAurora.com and I'm here at this old, abandoned, black and white playground where young, abandoned, black and white kids used to play together. They'd get together and play their jacks and their double dutch and freeze tag all with one thing on the mind. When am I going to get to have sex with your mom? All right, this is Aurora of AskAurora.com, and welcome to the season premiere and to an all new year. Um, thanks to everyone who continued to write questions while I was in my off season. Um, to those of you who I didn't get around to answering, all of you, I was drunk and I'm sorry. Um, getting back to it though, we have a lot of new things coming up. Feel free to check it out, it's all over the site. Don't worry about it. Plus, the playoffs are still on, we got about a month left. Put some money down. But getting back to our little mother Mother if I told you what you did was wrong, it wouldn't matter because you did it every way. If I told you to stop, you're probably not going to listen. So all I am going to do is thank you for allowing me, Aurora, to live vicariously through your actions. There are three things that every guy must commit and succeed in sexually in his lifetime. A, have a threesome. Very important. Very key. B, have sex with the milk. And the third is theirs of their own choice. Me personally, I'd like to have sex with a Native American midget knife juggler, but hey, to each their own, right? Whatever. You've already succeeded in it. And despite the fact that you have a wonderful girlfriend who actually deserves better, you're not gonna stop. So what I can tell you is this. Like any other risk, you have to protect your assets. You've been with her for six years. You're not gonna settle down with this cradle robber. It's not gonna happen. Fortunately, eventually you'll get too old and she'll go for your little brother. What you should do is this though. If you do wanna have fun and continue to kick with her, go right ahead. Cover your bases. Make sure your wifey does not find out because you will lose her. If on the other hand, you don't really care, then my advice is end it with her anyway. At least it's guilt-free sex, and you won't have to come home with cologne on you or with a breath mint, you know what I mean? Make life easy for yourself. So basically what I'm trying to say is before anything, figure out, do you really want to stay with her? Do you want her for the long run or not? If you don't, make it easy. If you do, don't screw up because you're not going to end up a grandma. It's not Aurora, that's Enjoy the rest of the season.